Hey everyone! Today I will try to duplicate my lenses using simple silicon molds and transparent resin. I prepared simple 3D printed boxes which will be used to pour the silicon into the square shape. I'll glue the original magnifier on the bottom so that I can pour the silicon over it. This way I'll get a perfect shaped silicon mold which will be used to cast the resin. I've used my glue gun to put a small blob of glue on the bottom. It's important to not use excess amount because it will be reflected on your silicone mold. I've also prepared a simple plastic cup which will help me measure the correct silicone proportions. I'll be using my kitchen scale to measure 50 grams of silicone solution. 50 grams of silicone solution works really well with 2 milliliters of silicone activator. I'll add the silicone activator using plastic syringe since it won't wave right on the scale. Do it slowly so you can avoid this. Now I just basically stir it for a while until it's a solid color. It should more or less look like this. Now with the silicone ready I can pour it into the 3D printed squares. I've got two here since I was basically filming two videos at once. Both pieces are now filled with silicone. I fill it way up to the top. I've let it sit for about two days and let it solidify. It's now ready to take out of the plastic casing. I'll use my knife to cut off the corners, this way I can remove the mold easily. If you cut off the one of the corners, rest of the plastic casing will just simply fall apart. It's the easiest way to disassemble. Here you can see that there's a hole where the lens connected with the plastic mold. I will use this hole to pour the resin into the mold. The first lens came out the mold easily. It was a bit snug, but that's good. Mold should now be ready for the resin. I fixed the hole a bit so it will be easier to pour the resin. Bigger hole means more space to maneuver. The second mold, however, didn't make it. For some reason, silicon got stuck to the lens, ruining the whole mold. There's not even an easy way to get the lens out. I've cut open the silicon in order to rescue my lens. It's a very unique piece and I don't want to lose it. Here you can see how the silicone got stuck on the lens. I didn't use any separator though. I prepared some clear resin which I will now pour into my mold. One of the molds came out ok so I will use it. Couple of days have now passed and I can finally get the resin out of the mold. Silicon is pretty stretchy so it shouldn't be a problem. As you can see, it's pretty cloudy, but overall it came out pretty good. I think I could fix the clouding with some clear lacquer, but I'm afraid it might be the resin's fault. I could also try sanding it down, but it takes way too much time. Quick side note while I was editing the video. You can simply get it wet under the sink, and if it's clear when it's wet, then you can simply polish it. I bought some premium clear lacquer for the car headlights. It should make my lens perfectly see-through. I've covered the lens with clear lacquer, but it's still somewhat foggy. I think I have to buy other lacquer. This one might not be so great in the end. I also need to buy the polishing kit, but that's for another time. Anyway, that's all for now. Thanks for watching. And as always, huge thanks to my patrons.